The first day of shooting was in the, um, the penthouse of the Hilton, New York Hilton Hotel. It's an early scene in the picture where she's trying to get Alan Bates to let her take a rest. She wants to take a rest. And then she has an interview with photographers and all that stuff. And it was a very difficult scene because we were up at the penthouse and all the windows had to be gelled and uh, I had a New York crew mixed with an L.A. crew and, and there was tension there, you know, and it's the first day of shooting. Uh, yes, we rehearsed for a week or so in a, in a rehearsal room, but Bette was terrified, terrified, or intimidated by the people who knew everything about filmmaking and to be playing a scene with Alan Bates, one of the great English actors who we lost quite recently. She was just shaking. So I start to walk over to her before the first, and I feel her arm on my shoulder. And it's Aaron Russo. Uh, Aaron Russo, as I said, was her manager and was a, a kind of um, mafiosa kind of thug, big, overweight bully. And he said, stops me, he says, what are you doing? I said, I'm going over to talk to Bet. He said, no, 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 no. You don't talk to Bet. You talk to me. I talk to Bet. I said, what? He says, you talk to me and I, you don't talk to Bet. I called the crew and I called Bet. I said, everybody come around here. I want you to hear this. He says to me that I cannot talk to Bet, that I have to talk to Bet through him. And I knew that this was a challenge that had to be met. We hadn't made a, she hadn't shot a frame of film. And she was his, uh, he was her manager. And they were lovers at one time. So it, it really took a chance. I said to Bet, I said, Bet, um, look, all he can do is get you a bigger trailer. I can make you go to this part. You must transfer your allegiance now, all this allegiance you have to him has to go out the window and you have to transfer it to me. You have to make this decision because I won't go on with the picture otherwise. And my heart was pounding because I knew I was taking a real chance. And she looked up at me and she said, okay. And I called, I said, call the police. I said, take this guy and get him out of here. I don't want to see him again. And they took him, this big burly guy, and they took him out of the, they, he was yelling, and they took him down the elevator, and he was out, and we started the picture. Of course, he called the studio, and I have to hand it to Alan Ladd and those people who backed me. You know, they said, Mark is the director, there's only one director. They were terrific.